Castor Jose Galvan paints, and his pictures are uncomfortable. Scattered with decapitated heads, blood and guns, they pour out his frustration at the drug-related violence rocking his country. The only thing Mexico has to offer its president or highest authority is children with the mentality of killers. This is a baby with a little AK-47. The pastor doesn't lack for inspiration. He lives in the desert on the outskirts of Ciudad Juarez, one of the cities most affected by Mexico's unrest. He runs an asylum there for around 100 mentally ill people and recovering addicts. This is a place where we recycle. We recycle people. God has told me to recycle the people here, in the middle of the desert. Galvan himself was recycled, deported from the US after falling into drug addiction and doing time in a US jail. Galvan turned to God when he returned to Mexico. He says all of the people at the center are, in some way, victims of the drug-related violence that has exploded in Ciudad Juarez. There have been 8,000 drug-related deaths there since 2008. Mental illness has shot up here exactly because of what's happening. There's no peace, the despondency, the disappointment, the feeling of impotence. These feelings put human beings under a lot of pressure. Until things change in Ciudad Juarez, Pastor Galvan will continue to care for his special congregation, providing them with the last refuge in a city that's no stranger to suffering.